being brave today. I'm going to get ready on camera. We're running out of time, people. We're running out of time. Exactly right. What do you wish? Do you want to wish? I wish so you would be nice to me. to the dance floor right this minute. Welcome back to Not Enough Nelsons. I am being brave today and I'm going to get ready on camera. And that's a brave thing to do when you are 48 years old. But you know what? It's good to be real, right? So I am going to take you along on a crazy day today because this is what's happening. We have got um, Little Ledger's birthday. His birthday is actually Friday, but we are leaving on Friday to go get tea. Offer permission. She has been serving in Washington, D.C., Spanish speaking. And so she has been serving so many people out there, so many um, people that have come from different countries and are just trying to get their families set up. And hi, buddy. Quick visit from Mr. B. So we're going to pick up Janie on Friday, and she is so excited. We are so excited to see her. She's going to kind of just take us around, um, introduce us to a bunch of her friends on her mission, um, a bunch of the families that she loves. And I am trying to um, have Ledger's birthday today so that um, it's not in the middle of chaos that so we can just really have a day and enjoy him. So this morning I have already had my morning devotional with the kids. Most of them are at cheer. The rest are getting ready for cheer. And I think Benji's gonna bring him. He was able to do that this morning while I film for you. And then Mr. B, Beckham, his baptism is coming up. And so we are actually gonna be having his baptism at the same weekend as Janie does her homecoming. Um, like uh, you might've saw it with um, Journey's homecoming. So after they get off of a mission, you generally have what's called a homecoming where they speak to the whole congregation kind of um, just about a subject that's assigned to them. This one is uh, this, I think the topic is loving others um, like our savior does. And so she's gonna be speaking about that and just like a few of the memories from her mission and things. And then everyone comes back to our house and we can just kind of have a get together and um, chat and just kind of honor Janie for her service. And so that will be on Sunday, but the Saturday before that, Mr. B is getting baptized. So whew, you're probably like, what the heck, what is going on? <laughs> so much stuff going on. I try to keep it straight, people. I try to keep it straight in my brain, but you see, like, right? It's hard to keep things straight. Now I know why sometimes I can't remember words. Anyway, so we are going to take Mr. B. We're going to go to a cute little store, get him a outfit and bring him to lunch and then go take some pictures of him just at a cute little spot at the park. And then I'm going to put together some little invitations then when the kids get done with cheer, we have got a fun video we are filming on Nenfam. So you'll have to watch that video on Nenfam, but it's super cute and it involves um, going to school, even though school is not in yet. And then when we get back, we will have Mr. Ledger's birthday party. He's getting so big. He is turning four years old today, five years ago about. I sat in this very bathroom and I just found out I was pregnant at 45 years old with my 16th child. <laughs> so that I sat on that bench right there behind me and cried for a solid half hour. Not really because I was sad, I was just really confused at like God's plan for me. Have you ever had that moment in life when you're just like, wow, this just came out of nowhere and I didn't know this was your plan for me, but I'm gonna adjust and this is gonna be great. And his plan for me has always been a thousand times better than I could ever plan it myself. And so that was very much the case with Ledger. Oh my goodness, Ledger is just such a bright little, um, just light in our home. He is just, so stinking fun. Okay, anywho, I need to put on some lipstick so I look like I'm alive. My kids buy like all these products. They know a lot more about makeup products than I do because I don't know, I just don't. 
I guess, care as much. <laughs> All right, are you ready to see the scary part? This is the scary part right here, people, right here. But guys, it is growing back, yay! And if you like know me, if you've followed us for a couple years, you know that I have struggled a little bit with hair loss through the years, especially after I had Ledger and then um, I ruptured a disc in my back. And so then I had back surgery and then um, I won't go into detail, but I had another surgery, basically putting everything back where babies break things inside. <laughs> anyway, I had a second surgery. And so I lost a ton of hair, I think because I just had those three big traumatic events all within like a year and a half of time plus I had been nursing and I quit nursing and that kind of messes up all your hormones. Anyway, I have done a lot of things. And I showed you some of those things in the past, but I feel like guys, I don't know, look how great. Like, I honestly feel like I have had a ton of hair growth. This just used to be bald clear back to here. Okay, so I'm gonna blow dry my hair. I won't bore you with me blow drying my hair, so I will see you in a minute. Blow drying complete. Even though I have tons of hair growth, I feel like a part of that is I have what's called a topper. I got that gifted to me um, after I did my video about my hair loss, amazing company called Lesta. When your hair is super thin, like you end up like doing a lot to it to try to get it to be poofier. And so I feel like with my topper, I haven't done a ton to damage my hair. And so I feel like especially at the base, it's getting way, way more um, just healthy and thick. I probably do need to like give it a really good trim, but the trap I'm in with the topper is I can't go super short because then it wouldn't like match up with the topper. And so anyway, comment down below what you, if I should just cut my hair and have short hair for a while while the rest of it like thickens up at the ends because the ends are super thin, or if you think I should just keep her in the topper for a while until the thickness kind of grows out. I love all of your opinions and your advice because last time I did my hair video, you guys gave me all kinds of good advice and I followed a lot of it and I feel like that's helped make a difference. So I appreciate all of you so much. So there is my, like all I have to do is just kind of put a little bit of movement and then this is my Lusta um, topper. So I'm gonna poke that on and see what I think today. I don't know. Today I've been kind of feeling like I might just do my natural hair because I've got so much going on. I just don't know if I want the heat. Um, it's so hot where I live. It's been like 107 and 100 and stuff degrees. But you just flip that, you line it up with your, um, kind of your part, and then you fill the clips and pull it down. Another thing I like to do is um, style it with like a little braid in the front because it just keeps the hair out of my face, especially on busy days. I like how a braid just holds it out of my face a little bit better. So if you see a braid in my hair, you know I'm having a busy day, people. Anywho, so I'm gonna take you along with me and we are going to have a great day. And it might seem a little chaotic, but that is just my life. It's my life. Okay, time to get dressed. Are you ready? Quick change. One, two, three. Okay, I know, I know. This is a super just chill outfit today. I know what you're thinking. You're like, wait, she's back in workout clothes. Guys, Lululemon's are so comfortable and I have a really busy day, so it's okay. And I know, I know I'm a little colorful and I look a little bit like a watermelon, but you know what? I like to dress happy. And I learned something years ago. You are always enough and you are never too much. And so, you be you. It's all good. Words to live by. Okay, I gotta go review a couple videos and then I'm gonna get Mr. V and go have a fun little afternoon. This is what I mean by I look a little bit like a watermelon. I didn't show you the lower half. Um, I'm green and pink. I'm stopping in because, hi, Paisley. Hi. She did like new countertop, yeah. a new kind of like makeup area in her bathroom and I did the other little girl's bathroom. I'm gonna show you a little tiny snippet of how it's coming because of course I have to make it into a makeover video, right? So let's look at hers. Look how nice. Like a vanity, so like yes. Yeah, like a spot. How nice is this, you guys? And this hasn't been installed yet. We just like sat it in there to see what it looks like. But oh, it's gonna be so nice. So this is the little girls. Ugh. See, I'm probably showing you guys too soon. So forget you ever saw this. All right. So I'm leaving Paisley to put back all of her stuff 
in our cabinets. How fun is that? I know, it's like our house is only, let's see, six years old, but six years with 16 kids is like equal to like 25 years with most people. And so I had to like redo some things, but it's okay. It is what it is when you got kids. So this is our YouTube kind of space. This is Gab, you guys know her. Um, Ledger is? He's with Benji in the yard. Okay, so Ledger's with Benji in the yard. And this is where I usually work. And so I will review the videos and then go get Mr. Beast. A little sneak peek and insider thing is that we forgot to do an intro to our Drunk Elephant night routine. So I'm gonna quickly film that. So if you guys watch that video, it's on Men Fam, you will see that I am in the same outfit. I'm gonna hurry and do that and then finish reviewing a couple more videos. Hey guys, welcome back to Men Fam. So today I'm gonna take all of my girls. I'll have to figure out the different houses. So copy, yeah, no, remember you have to copy in there, yes. And then poke it into uh, point three zero. So we're changing the songs. We're changing the songs, people. We have to change the songs on this part because it wasn't quite the right song. So total sneak peek. This is who does my thumbnails and look at all of these cute pictures. Can you guess what video this might be for? <laughs> This will be a video on Nentap. Yeah, that one pretty much gives it away. Anyway, you guys will have to watch out for that thumbnail. Super cute. All right, guys. We are on our way. What you didn't see is like finding Mr. B, getting him to get in the shower, get ready for the day, and getting him to get buckled in the car properly and all that. That is why I'm sweating, people. Okay, but. We are on our way to go, we're gonna do frozen yogurt and we're going to go buy his cute outfit. Yes, at Yogurt Land. I think we're gonna do Yogurt Land first because this movie looks a little bit hot back there. Welcome, sir. You're so official. Thank you, ma'am. Something black. Get your shirts on back. What? Let's see. No way. Sure enough, look, there's the tag. It has two stains. Oh, you did that on purpose because it had the little stain. <laughs> okay, you two, we don't know that. Oh, but I do. I think that the sun kissed the top of your ears. <laughs> and you got lots of cute sun kisses on your nose. The sun must really like you a lot. All right, let's go find your cute, handsome outfit. Yay! Walk me in the morning sun. Tell me I'm a lucky one. I'm riding on the way of an ocean that I could this be This looks brave. like dying. I'm sorry. Turn it up loud and let me know how we used to be. That's a lot. Now I need to go make some quick invitations and then we gotta go film a video. So we better hurry. We're running out of time, people. We're running out of time. Three hours later. I just finished filming with these guys. Whew, it's been a long day, but now it is time to go home and get everything ready for Ledger's birthday party. I think it's gonna be super cute. But you gotta go upstairs first and get ready, okay? And I'm gonna blow up the balloons and get out your presents and your birthday cake. And guess what we gonna do tonight? Party party, party, party in the pool. Woo! All right, Lily is getting ready the BLTs. <laughs> yes, do not mind all that grease. Got some yummy bacon going on, yummy corn, and we're gonna have a pasta salad. So I need to yes. mix that one up. Happy birthday, son. Oh, no. Happy birthday. 
birthday party. Yeah. Oh, oh, my God. God. Okay, guess what? This is how old you are. This is what it looks like to be a four. Yeah? You like a four? Four. He's all ten. All right. Do you want to have dinner or do you want to open your presents first? Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right, guys. We have got all the kitties. You guys all have your presents? Yeah. All right. It's time for your first present, Ledger. All right. Let's give you this one first. Pajamas and underwear. Do you like them? Oh, yeah. yeah. Good. All right. Next one. Come on to me. Come on to me. Oh. Hey. Oh. 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 What's this? So cool. Oh, those. Oh. 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 Yeah. Wait, what do you do, Lester? What do you think? I think they look good. I'm going to take the pajamas off. You think they're great? Yeah, I'm just going to take them off. You want to take my ribbon off? Sorry, I put a little too much room on that one. Abby, <laughs> can I sing you a song? Oh, yeah. That's a 
good idea? Yeah. yeah. I want to do Beckham next. That's so cool. All right, Beckham, 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 your presence next, I guess. Big one. Oh, wow. Oh, you better. Do this, okay, I'm going to open this up. Yeah. I 
think mom would be nice to me. Oh, oh. <laughs> we're all such good wishes of everyone being nice. <laughs> Woo! That was a big crazy day and my kids are all growing up so fast and days go by too fast. It feels like I just want to push pause like I always say. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. Bye-bye.